This woman had a dream to become a top model. To do this she decided to start with a magazine shoot. Right at the beginning, the man asks Lisa to take off her coat, to reveal more of her skin. Lisa hesitates for a moment. She had to compromise in order to become famous quickly. But even so, the man is still not satisfied. Lisa even wondered if she had misheard. This was completely out of her league. So she grabbed her backpack and left the studio with a vengeance. Lisa went home to surf the internet. She came across an ad for a model, and it was all inclusive of food and accommodation. No no work experience was required, a bonus for the duration of the internship. Faced with such an excellent offer, Lisa sent in her CV. She was soon sent a job offer, so she got on a train and headed for her destination. By the time Lisa arrived, Matt immediately arranged an audition for her. He complimented her on her talent as a model. He invited Lisa to a nice dinner. Then he took her to a small room. Lisa was delighted with the place too. Little did she know that this was just the beginning of a nightmare. After Matt had left, Lisa suddenly remembered she hadn't brought her bags in, but found the door unlocked. She rapped on the window and called out. But Matt didn't seem to hear anything. Lisa then realized the seriousness of the situation. She immediately picked up the phone in her room and called the police. Matt's voice came on the phone. Get comfortable. You're gonna be here a while. Matt just watched in silence as Lisa panicked on the CCTV. The next day, Matt came into the small room and told her what she wanted. She used Lisa's mother as a threat. She asked her to make money for her online. Lisa had no choice but to give in. Looking at all the clothes in the cloakroom, Lisa knew she could only escape if she could please Matt. Putting on sexy red lips, putting on black rimmed glasses. You can do this. Lisa gently gyrates her body to the music, and changing styles at Matt's request. She became more and more skilled in front of the camera. The online audience was captivated by her. Lisa's popularity quickly rose to the top of the charts. Even Matt became obsessed with her. She was so charming and feminine. But all Lisa did was look for a way to escape, and she didn't want to do it. It was Lisa's birthday, and Matt gave her a present. Lisa opened it and saw. It was a sexy, intimate nightgown. Although she knew Matt's intentions, but she didn't dare to resist. She had to pretend she was happy and put it on. Seeing that Matt was in a good mood, Lisa asked to go to the mall for a while. She had spent too much time in the room. Matt readily agreed. They went to a clothing shop. Lisa tried to leave a message of distress in the fitting room, but Matt caught her red-handed. Back inside the villa, Matt throws Lisa onto the bed in a fit of rage. Lisa was so frightened that she apologized to Matt and promised she would never run away again to punish Lisa, so he had his female assistant come into her room with a whip. After a passionate double act, the assistant reassured Lisa that it's all temporary, just bear with it. Meanwhile, Lisa's boyfriend saw what had just happened. She started to locate Lisa with the help of Jack, and after the escape, Matt is no longer compassionate. She asks Lisa to take off her clothes for the camera, to draw on her body. It's an idea that makes even the perverted me feel perverted. Lisa knew she had to get out of there. That night, she used her knowledge of physics to create a smoke bomb, and managed to set off the fire alarm. When Matt came to the door to check it out, Lisa instantly overpowered Matt with her high heels, and then immediately ran out to find a phone to call the police. As soon as the phone was answered, when Matt arrived and cut the line, this time he was totally pissed off. So he dug a big hole in his backyard. He was going to kill Lisa and make a live feed. Later that night, Lisa's boyfriend finally found the place. It doesn't matter how he located it. Looking at her boyfriend, who was tied up, Lisa remembered the conversation between Matt and his assistant. What's that? Oh, I'm so sorry. Get ready for your kiss, Hunter. Lisa swallowed the small snack in one big gulp, then she walked straight up to Matt. Matt finally fell at Lisa's feet. Everything was back to normal. Rana, Rana.